He was known for his novels and screenplays, capturing the complexities of life in Northern Ireland during and after the Second World War. He was recognized for his insightful exploration of the intercommunal divisions of the Troubles, making him one of the most esteemed contemporary novelists. His name is Brian Moore. In the world of literature, one name stands out for his captivating exploration of the human experience, Brian Moore, a novelist and screenwriter from Northern Ireland. Born in Ireland, Moore later emigrated to Canada and eventually settled in the United States. His novels became renowned for their vivid depictions of life in Northern Ireland during and after World War II, particularly his poignant portrayal of the intercommunal divisions of the Troubles. Moore's literary genius earned him widespread acclaim and the title of one of the few genuine masters of the contemporary novel. His works resonated with readers as he delved into the complexities of human relationships amidst a backdrop of political turmoil. His profound understanding of the human psyche allowed him to craft narratives that captured the essence of the human experience. One of Moore's notable achievements was winning the prestigious James Tate Black Memorial Prize in 1975, which recognized his exceptional contribution to literature. Additionally, his novel was chosen as the inaugural Sunday Express Book of the Year in 1987, solidifying his position as a literary luminary. Moore's remarkable talent was further acknowledged through his nomination for the Booker Prize three times, a testament to his profound impact on the literary world. Not only an acclaimed novelist, Moore also ventured into the world of screenwriting, adapting several of his novels into captivating films. His ability to translate his literary prowess onto the silver screen showcased his versatility and further cemented his status as a creative force to be reckoned with. Brian Moore's legacy as a writer continues to inspire and captivate audiences worldwide. His ability to illuminate the human condition through his words remains unparalleled, leaving a lasting impact on the literary landscape. His contributions to both literature and film serve as a reminder of the power of storytelling and its ability to connect people across time and space. In the world of literature, Brian Moore's greatest literary achievement lies in his exploration of various novels and themes. Born in Belfast, Moore initially started his writing career in Canada, where he penned his first novels. These early works were thrilling tales, often published under different pseudonyms such as Bernard Mara or Michael Bryan. While Moore later distanced himself from these pulp fiction novels, they marked the beginning of his writing journey. However, it was Moore's novel, Judith Hearn, that truly established his reputation as a talented writer. This novel, which Moore considered his first true work outside the thriller genre, remains highly regarded to this day. Interestingly, the book faced multiple rejections from American publishers before finally finding a home with a British publisher. It was later adapted into a film, with the renowned British actress Maggie Smith portraying the poignant character of the lonely spinster. Throughout his career, many of Moore's novels were also adapted for the silver screen, showcasing his versatility as a writer. Works such as, Intent to Kill, The Luck of Ginger Coffee, Catholics, Black Robe, Cold Heaven, and The Statement all found their way onto the big screen. Moore even collaborated with renowned director Alfred Hitchcock, co-writing the screenplay for Torn Curtain. Additionally, he wrote the screenplay for The Blood of Others, based on Simone de Beauvoir's novel, Le Sang de Autres. Moore's novels often delved into his personal experiences and beliefs, particularly his criticism of his Belfast schooling. In works like The Feast of Lupercal and The Emperor of Ice Cream, he openly expressed his discontent with the education system. Furthermore, Moore tackled staunchly anti-doctrinaire and anti-clerical themes in some of his novels, offering a sharp critique of the influence of the church on Irish society. He frequently explored the concept of the Catholic priesthood, examining the crisis of faith that priests might experience. However, it's crucial to note that Moore's works also contained sympathetic portrayals of faith and religious struggles, with Black Robe being a prime example. Brian Moore's literary legacy lies in his ability to captivate readers with his diverse range of novels and thought-provoking themes. From thrilling tales to deeply introspective works, Moore's writing continues to resonate with audiences around the world. Do you want to explore more novelists? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.